friend, this is Shifakat Ali and welcome to Technical Skills YouTube channel. In the previous video, we have took the data from input fields and show it on text view. In this video, we will see the concept of activity and intent. So in the previous video, we have created a set on click listener and store the data from input field. So now there is no need of uh, that text view. So first we have to delete this text view. And also there is no need of this text view set text. Now what is activity? If you want to understand the concept of activity, activity is nothing but a simple android screen. That have two main files, activity.java and activity.xml. The main detail I have already told you about activity. Java and activity.xml. So first of all we set a intent. Intent is nothing but communication between the activity. If you want to shift it from one activity to another activity then we will use intent. So here I have already set a click listener. So I want to shift from one activity to another activity when I click on this button. So first of all, I change the name of this save button. Go to the main activity.xml and click on this button. Now click on the text and here you can see text is saved. So I change the text to send. Save it. Now go to main activity.java. Here when I click on this button, then if transfer to another activity. So for, for this we have to create a new activity. How we can create a new activity? Just click on this java folder and right click click on new and then here you can see activity and select here empty activity. Select the name of the activity. I select second activity and click on finish now I have two activity so let's create an intent to transfer from one activity to another activity intent is equal to new intent first parameter is context and the second parameter is activity name in my case the second activity is a second activity so i type the name of this activity is second activity dot class now start activity and pass this intent object to this activity okay when I click on this button, then a intent is created and it shifted from one activity to and from one activity to another activity. So let's test it. You can see application is running on with emulator and let's say type here and type any name and when I click on send it will transfer from one activity to another activity 
but it will not transfer the text let's click on this send button you can see the second activity is open now the next thing is we have to send this text that I have already stored from the input field to the next activity so how we transfer this text from one activity to another activity so create a input extra input extra intent dot put extra here you need to type two arguments first argument is key my key is first is a name for email and the second parameter is email store Similarly, intent dot put extra it should be string. Okay, now key is name and name store, it will transfer email and name to that activity in the next activity we need to collect this email and name so we have to create two text view on the second activity so open the second activity xml file here we need two text view so let me drag it set the constraint Increase the width of text view. Control C and Control V to create a duplicate. Okay. Now, now first give the ID text view email. Second one is text view name and remove the text from text view similarly from second one okay now in second activity dot java class we have to access that data from intent so how we get data from intent just here we need to create two string variable email intent dot get string extra and pass the key that we already initialized in the main activity you can see here emails and name so first pass the email and similarly control d press to duplicate the line name and similarly here name now it get the data from intent and stored email and name now we need to access the text view so create a private text view text view email and View name. Now initialize it. Text view email is equal to find view by id r dot id dot text view email and similarly text view name is equal to find view by id r dot id dot name now we have initialized the text view and now we need to set the text to text view how we set the text 
text view dot set text and pass the variable that contain data contain data similarly text view name dot set text and pass the variable that contains second data now run the application and test it You can see application is running on emulator. Let's type email abc and is abc and click on send button. You can see now second activity is open but it contain also email and name. Thanks for watching. See you next video. Take care. Bye.